Margaret Hamilton was a famous actress who is well known for her performance in the 1939 cult classic film, The Wizard of Oz. She was famously known for portraying the Wicked Witch of the West. She is nowadays still well known for her role. Margaret Hamilton was born in 1902 and lived in Cleveland, Ohio. Her father was an important lawyer. Her parents wanted her to have a job where she could be self-sufficient, meaning she could support herself. Although she would play the Wicked Witch of the West in The Wizard of Oz, she originally worked as a kindergarten teacher. While working at the school, she helped a friend get a role in a play called Another Language. Hamilton herself ended up having a role in the play. The play became a success and was even turned into a film. And it was this role that opened the doors to Hollywood. She had starred in over 70 films where she would commonly play an unlikable woman. But although she'd starred in 70 films, one role would make her a legend. In 1939, she was chosen to play the Wicked Witch of the West in the 1939 film, The Wizard of Oz. The film was a role that made her famous, but behind the scenes, it was a living hell. While filming the scene where she exits from Munchkinland, something went wrong and she got second and third degree burns. After the incident, she didn't want to star in any more scenes that used fire. Margaret Hamilton was known for her role as the Wicked Witch of the West from the film The Wizard of Oz, and that legacy continued throughout her life. In 1975, she starred in an episode of Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood. In this episode, she showed the audience that acting is like pretending as she dressed as the witch from the film. In 1976, she starred in Sesame Street, where she once again played her iconic role. Sadly, in 1985, Margaret Hamilton had passed away. She was 82.